Hey guys, it's me, Kim, or Sissy, and I thought I would get on here and do a chat. Let's see if I'm a hook. Uh, as you can tell, I'm congested. I feel like crud. <clears throat> but life carries on. Oh, um, you hear Jackson in the background. I have been going back and forth on um, crafting YouTube and booktube YouTube and stuff and I feel like I am so out of the loop with the crafting YouTube. I don't keep up with it like I used to and I don't know, I just feel out of the loop with everything. I'm not as up to date with the new people and stuff. Um, I don't know. It's definitely different. That's for sure. I've been thinking about... I know a lot of people have said, you know, just do a video every once in a while and not quit, but I've been going back and forth about quitting the, um, my channel for the, um, the podcast. Not deleting it, just letting it set and stuff because I don't craft as much or I don't record as much of my crafting as I used to. But um, if I did do that, I would keep up the um, still the podcast groups on Facebook and stuff. I wouldn't get rid of the group. But hang on, please. I guess I'm back. I wouldn't be um recording on the channel but I would be um doing more in the group posting wise I know I still post on um, Instagram and all that but I don't know I've just been really debating because I feel like I've lost my place in the community where I have stepped back a whole lot and and I also feel like I've lost a lot of friends, too. And it's it's not their fault. It's not my fault, in a way. But life just gets you busy. And once you step back, it's like... I don't know. You just don't feel as connected to the crafting community as you once did. That's the way I feel. I know that sounds weird. Oh, but I, I have made a lot of friends through the community with crochet, knitting, and different crafts. And I've also made friends through the booktube community. And I'm doing good on my videos on that channel, but this one, I guess I have fall, fallen tremendously behind with videos except for maybe vlogging here or there once every month or no once every two months I'll do a podcast I've seen or once every three months so I mean it has definitely gone down um because looking back I was I did really good on my videos and then after having Jackson with him and three kids, it's just gone down. And that, and that's that's understandable with three kids. Your your life is constantly changing and stuff. But like I said, I think I might just let it sit and try and get more involved with the Facebook page and the rivalry when I can. But. I definitely 
toy feel like? I hear you, buddy. I have lost touch with the community. That's for sure. And I try to stay connected with the different people and stuff and post, but I just, I don't know. I'm out of sleep, that's for sure. This is coming out pretty. I can't wait to get this finished. Off topic. I know it's, Jackson's going to love it. I put it in his crib and stuff. He's got an appointment today. He's supposed to get shots and stuff. Um, let me get a second. Okay, sure. Oh. We did get Randy placed into a, sorry, hair, a nurse assistant women's facility. It's a nursing home. And the people there are really good with him. Sorry, ice. And he seems to like it. He likes the socialization and he's adjusting well. So that was a blessing in disguise. Scarlett's loving her pre-K. The teachers are doing good with her. I did put her in the public school system. And so far, she seems to be doing good. Me and her father are involved in the stuff she does. So, I think she's going to do well. But, and I'm working on Zach with potty training and stuff. Um, he's doing good. He's a little daredevil. Last night... I told him to stop jumping on the bed. We're in the bedroom. All of a sudden, this child goes flying. And he hits the pack. He busts his lip. I'm like, dude, you can't jump on the bed and go flying like Superman. You can't fly. Even if you put your mind to it, you can't do it. We're not built that way. So I'm hoping he learned his lesson. He won't jump on the bed no more. That's because mm -mm, it ain't going to happen. He's a boy. They don't learn not that way. They, they, they gonna do it again. Do it or die. That's like Mama used to say. But that's what's been going on with us and stuff. And, uh, this change of the weather and sinuses drives you nuts. I hate falling away. Because every time it, it turns out to never fails. I get everybody in the family get a darn sinus infection. I can't stand it. Uh, but I've knitted on Matt's hat. Got a little ways to go. Once I finish that, I'll post a picture on Instagram or on Facebook in the crafting group. But we'll see. Have you guys felt that way about when you podcast and stuff, or am I the only one? I don't know. Maybe I am burned out. I don't. I don't get it. Um. They did, well, that was during the summertime, after I had Jackson, they bumped up my anxiety medicine and stuff, but I don't feel anxious, I'm just tired, <laughs> what I suspected with three kids, um, I guess, I feel like I lost my mojo for crafting. Which sucks because I really enjoy it. Are you taking to King Kong? Goodness gracious, what'd he do? I don't know. I just feel like I lost my mojo. I know that I've lost contact with certain people and stuff. And sometimes you make friends, you lose friends. And sometimes life just gets in the way, but I don't know. I just feel like I have definitely lost touch with the community. But that's what I just wanted to sit down and talk about what I've been thinking about and I'm still iffy about what I'm going to do, but um, the channel will stay up no matter what, even if I don't video, do videos or podcast for a little while, but, um, the groups, the, um, podcast group, slash yarn addiction group, 
it will always be up on Facebook. Yeah. Um, yeah, and a rivalry. But, um, yeah. my YouTube channel you, videos you might can. not be as active. Yeah. I don't know. It just depends how life is. Yeah, and it might be I can step back for a little while from videoing at making videos at all. Will you please stop that? You don't need to be doing that. That is ugly. Yeah. Yeah. Don't take down Tong with your shoes, okay? No. Would you want somebody hit you with your shoes? No. Why would you do it to Kong? Anyways, that's my video and my um import 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 important. <laughs> I can't even talk. Um, just important discussion. I hope I said that right. Anyways, hope you guys have a blessed Thursday. And if you want to message me or just talk or whatever, you can um, do that on Ravelry or on Instagram, my Facebook, or you can comment down below. But um, hope you guys have a wonderful week and be blessed. Bye, guys.